everybody and welcome to another live stream here on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. That's me, I'm Johnny Chiodini and today we're going to be playing the absolutely delightful looking tunic which um, people have um, people have sort of uh, like I've so this game's been in development for ages and I've played it for 10 minutes at PAX once back in approximately the 5th century, I don't know, it feels like a very long time ago now. Um, and uh, apart from that, I haven't really touched it or looked at it or anything. I just know that it's basically like you are a fox with a sword and a shield, and it's quite Zelda-like. Um, and frankly, when I booted this up and um, was just sort of putting it into into OBS and making sure everything was running before the stream, I saw this sword and I heard this music, which hopefully you can hear and it isn't too quiet. I've turned it up a little bit. We'll see how that goes. I can always adjust the audio. Uh, but either way, that made me think, yeah, I think this game is, I think we're in quite good hands here. I think they've probably read the briefing. Um, so yeah, without any further ado, let us become a tiny little fox, shall we? How is everybody? It's very nice to see you all. Um, ooh oh, 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 I see. I mean, num, 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 num. Oh, Shut up. I'm in. I'm sold. Done. Love this already. I mean, it's... Yeah. Getting very... Uh, especially the... Oh, dear. Oh, my stamina. Sorry. Um, getting very... Uh, Legend of Zelda uh, Link Awakens remake vibes. But also... <laughs> a good amount of Death's Door in here. And also some Mon Monument Valley. As Mr. McWaggle says... Ooh, buttery. Um, but yeah, how is everybody? I hope you're all well. Uh, I'm not lung up from a nap. I'm not going to lie. I had a little bit of a, um, had a bit of a, a quiet, not quiet, a bit of a late night last night. So I went out and and uh, went went to a pub to do a pub quiz, and we came first, uh, and it was very good fun. Um, and our team name was, I mean, sorry to interrupt the quiz, but I've just received word that the Queen has died. And the quiz master played it perfectly. He was like, uh, there are two teams left. One of them is called the Bad Babes, and the other one is, oh, everyone, I'm so sorry to interrupt the quiz. And we were sat there like, he's doing it. Uh, it was great. There was an audible gasp, but then he was like, that's the name of the team, everybody. Uh, and then we won, so... Sorry to any royalists, but um, get a grip. <laughs> um, anyway, right, to kick us off, um, we've got a super chat from Nicholas Grammer. He says, morning, Johnny, just finished breakfast, which consisted of 13 extra large eggs and two English muffins. This game is delightful. P.S. you were right. Buying a house is a huge pain in my left thumb. Indeed. Good Lord. Um, 13 extra large eggs. That's more eggs than I've... I was about to say more eggs than I've ever eaten in my life. That's a barefaced lie, but that's definitely more eggs than I've ever eaten in one sitting. Um, I don't know what... Ooh, camera stuff. I don't know what this does, but... Uh, I'm sure we'll find out in due course. Jesse Belangus done a super chat saying, Hello, LSPs and JC. We'll catch up on VOD, but off to get my third tattoo in a few minutes. Looking forward to a lovely experience. You get, you've already had two tattoos in the last few minutes. Sorry, I had to do it. Um, good luck, uh, Jesse. Keep your blood sugar up uh, and just try and stay still. That's all you have to do. Um, Emily Hill's done a super chat. It's of a peach. It looks like a butt. <laughs> um, but anyway, do we have mail? No, we don't have mail. Um, mm -mm. Let's just have a little push around and see what we can find. I really love how the these little uh, clumps of foliage move. It reminds me of um, like sound insulation tiles when you get those knobbly little bits. Manish Anand has done a super sticker. The super sticker is of a pear. Um, now, it's, I'm glad we, we're getting this out of the way early. A pear is a piece of fruit. Uh, this piece of fruit is more rounded at the bottom and it is kind of narrower at the top. This one has a, a stalk here uh, and a leaf um, which is where it was attached to the tree. So if, you know, we obey the laws of gravity and consider that to be down and that to be up, that's how we know it's rounder and larger at the bottom. But um, that's, you know, that's a property of uh, typical of a, a normal pear anyway. This one is a little bit different in that it has arms and legs and a face and um, a, a pair of sunglasses, which it's pulling off 
or halfway down its face repeatedly while turning around and going, hey you, as if to say, Manishan and through the medium of a pair, is saying, hello, um, thank you very much Manish, hello to you too. Or should I say, hey you, let's see what's in here, shall we? It is a stick. Stick, found a stick. LB, now we can, okay, yep, that's our stick. Aha, we can equip the stick to X. No, or B or Y. Great. I love, absolutely love, that, wow, that's a lazy swing, isn't it? I love that the, um, there's, I mean, I don't recognize this as any actual alphabet in, in you know, human society, uh, but I love that they've stuck it in the menus. That's brilliant. Oh, oh, we can check our mail. I think that might have meant there is no mail. Yeah. Meeple of Britain says, Hi Johnny, hope you're well and enjoying this deceptively cute looking game. Uh-oh. The fox isn't a racist, is it? I, th I No, I've heard this is quite challenging, actually. So... Mm, now we've got three c coins. Those look horrible. Little insectoid bastards. There's a cat enjoying a bath. It's absolutely massive and made of stone. Mrs. Treeman says, is there no way to change the scripted language? Doesn't seem like it. I think it's just... Eh, I think it's just sort of a cutesy, like, in-world thing. Hero's grave. Knock, knock. David Story says, break the jars. I... Oh, yeah. There were some jars back down there, weren't there? Let's push on for a bit. I'm sure we'll be going back that way anyway. Mmm, a chest. I Look how cute that is that we're looking down at it. That is adorable. We don't seem to be able to reach it. Eh. Delightful. Delightful. What's this way? Town. Let's push on this way, shall we? Helen Robinson says, is it deceptively cute because the fox has killed Link and stolen his tunic? We can only we can only guess, but my assumption is yes. So, right, we can't get that way anyway, right now. Claire de Bear has done a super chat saying, Hi Johnny, Mummy Bear Sue is over for a few days and we are watching this chill stream. Can you wish her a happy Mother's Day on my behalf? Absolutely. Mummy Bear Sue, a very happy Mother's Day to you. Um, thank you for having a hand in, in uh, the the creation and raising of um, such a delightful person as Claire de Bear, um, who is lovely to have around in this in this chill community. Uh, enjoy the stream. I hope I don't say anything objectionable. Could happen. I've already started spicier than I thought I was going to with that, that jibe about royalists, but there we go. Um, ah! Well, now, you can see here that these enemies have returned, respawned, you might say. Um, after I interacted with this, which I guess we can take to be some sort of checkpoint. Ooh, hello. Yes. That, that to me, looks suspiciously like an key. So we're going to go put that in th the door that we found earlier for the hero's grave. Oh, bloody hell. Look at these lads. Okay. Sonny <laughs> Malhotra says, uh, Royalist and Fox Racism, it's what we're here for. Hello, nice to see you in chat. Uh, Sonny and I saw one another on Tuesday, played a game of Merchants and Marauders, uh, which I did terribly at, frankly, but I still adore. Um, and then we played, tried to play Love Letter in French, uh, which is difficult when you don't really speak French, but it was good fun. Because if there is a cherished game that you all enjoy, why not try playing it in French? There we go. Yes. <laughs> oh, I love the way he just punched that key into the door. Smash! 
Yes, what? Oh, hello. Beginning your adventure. <gasps> I love this. Ringing the great, ringing the east bell. East, blah, blah, blah. Hero's grave, guard captain. Ringing the west bell. Old house. For... God, we've even got a. <laughs> this is adorable. Everything hurts way more when I'm tired. Oh. This is great. This is apps, and you can zoom in. And it's got that lovely texture of like an actual comic. Look at this. This is so good. Robert Devlin says, Hello, Johnny. I haven't watched your streams in a while. When did you get a tattoo of Alan Moore on your hand? This one's like over a year old now. And it's, it's, a, it's a green man. Not Alan Moore, but... Oh, everyone is very much relating to the fox saying everything hurts more when I'm tired. Oh. Wah. Okie dokie. Hmm. A and chest. But it is a chest that has already been opened. That's interesting. Let's go down this way. Lion Lobster says, I spent way too long just flipping that page. I do not blame you. Right, let's see if we can get down here. Captain Shiny says, well, looks like I have another game I'm buying after I finish Loop Hero. Uh, yeah, this is actually on Game Pass if you subscribe to such a thing. Um, which, like, frankly, I'm, I'm going to sound like I'm shilling here. I'm really not. Um, but I think games, Game Pass is f ridiculous value. Like... There are so many games where I've been like, oh, I want to buy that. And I'm like, oh, it's just on Games Pass. I'll just listen to that, play it on Games Pass. Good, good to know. Whatever that said. Pots, let's go smash them. Enemies will smash them also. There we go. Hmm. Wasn't as satisfying as I hoped it would be. Burrito says Alan Moore is owed royalties now. Please don't tell Alan Moore. I, I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that Alan is probably doing fine. Um, and if he is interested in sort of chewing into the revenue of uh, a, a, a streamer, just because they have a tattoo of a bearded man on their hand. Uh, I'm going to say that's, not, that's just not a nice thing to do. Anyway, uh, Brian Mullard has done, wow, a massive super chat. Um, uh, who says, Hi Johnny, I want to thank you for choosing not to highlight games by abusive publishers. I'm tempted to purchase many of the games you play, and I also don't want to support such publishers. So thank you again, and I'll be back to enjoy this on VOD. Uh, you are very welcome, Brian. It's like, it's a very easy decision for me to make or it feels like a very straightforward choice just to not to just to boycott uh those developers or publishers rather um with abusive practices um or a history of abuse until they change things but i'm also i'm also very much aware that that is uh being able to make that decision is a very much a luxury for me because obviously like the vast the vast the vast majority of um uh, the money I make comes from Patreon, so um, I'm not relying on, say, publishers booking adverts with me or, or anything like that. Or necessarily from keeping my page views up by covering hotly anticipated games. So, like, I really... I appreciate that other sites are in a bind. I'm not... By doing this, basically, I'm not saying, and if anyone else doesn't do that, sod them. Um, it's just, like... It's something I'm glad to be able to, to do. And <laughs> this is great. Okay. RB is health potion. RT is shield. X, Y, or B can be weapons. We know about locking on with left trigger. Oh. Uh, we, we know about left stick. We know about A. LB is bring up that menu. Cool. All right. Uh, but yeah. Uh, thank you anyway. Uh, and Nick Jeffrey is on Super Chat saying, Hi Johnny, just watch, just finished watching you get thrown into the sun ring. Your sheer annoyance at the number of Eclipse tickled me. Ah yes, Horizon Zero Dawn. 
Oh, yeah, there's a lot of Eclipse. There's a lot of them. Bloody Sun, sun King, Sun Ring. Uh, I really hope you're enjoying that series. Um, and thank you very much for the super chat. I hope you're well. Ooh, hello. Right. Well, this is basic. It's this is basically a bonfire. I missed the back page of that. Apparently, can I access it again? Yes. Oh yeah, there we go. Look, I can roll. Oh, I can. If I press and hold, I do a little dash. Is that what that is? It's adorable, whatever it is. <laughs> oh, I keep tiring out the fox. <laughs> Emma Benton says, Horizon Zero Dawn, you say? I would say I've been summoned, but I'm already here. Ruthie Pinion says, Eclipse just makes me think of that old Jaffa Cake advert. That it that has lodged itself so firmly into everyone's brain, hasn't it? Deservedly so. Ow, fuck. Oh, no. Well, this is going very badly now. Why can't I hit you? Oh, crap. Oh, I changed the button for my stick. Get wrecked. Was that a cool thing? Was that, did I get away with saying get Rex just then? I don't think I did. I de definitely not now I'm drawing attention to it. I'm just trying to sort of put things in perspective here. Will's, Will says that Jaffa Cake advert is bullshit and it makes me very mad. Why is that, Will? Is it because they should be saying New Moon, not Total Eclipse? For not to sound like um, whatever that show was that everyone quoted for a bit and I didn't watch. And Oh, I got one of them to kill another one. Friendly fire is on for enemies. That's good news. Um, what what is, what is a new moon but a, uh, a, an eclipse of the moon enduring? Dr. Branga says, Hotter take, Jaffa cakes suck. They're not my favourite. I think they're nice enough. One, yes. Two, that is not a half moon. It's a crescent moon because it's shaped like a crescent. Understood. Okay, it's a terminology issue. That is that is fair. I can respect that. Guardhouse one. Gosh, there's a lot of you. And I'm quite hurt, but we'll make... We'll, We'll just keep going. Take that! That feels more my level, doesn't it? Rather than get wrecked. Burrito has done a super chat saying, How are you, friend? Do you like the Watchmen comic? Or the TV show? The film is garbage and doesn't count, lol. I've never seen the TV show, and... Um, this is fun. This is a bit of retro pandemic stuff. Um, I got swine flu when that was a thing. And I got quarantined for a week. Wasn't allowed to leave the house. You may be familiar with this sort of thing. Um, but at the time, having to, having to not leave the house for, um, for a whole week was torturous. I watched The Sopranos until my eyes went square. Um, I... <laughs> Simon Bruft says... How do you heal in this game? Might be a good time to know. Uh, potions, but I don't have any yet. Um, but yeah, I was I was basically... Uh, I was locked inside the house for a whole week, and I got bored of sleeping, I got bored of playing video games, I got bored of watching things, like, I was just very... Oh, I died. I just got very... Oh, no, I'm like Sonic the Hedgehog! I dropped all of my bits. Um... Okay, this would be a tutorial-y type thing. Oh, no, I'm this little spirit fox. Um, but, yeah, the uh, words words are hard. I read the graphic novel of Watchmen cover to cover during a day, like, in one sitting. And then I watched the film immediately afterwards, so I feel like I really absorbed Watchmen. And I thought the film wasn't very good, but I also thought it wasn't dreadful. Um, 
but I haven't watched the TV show, and it was 2000 and... 10? It would have been 2010 when I had swine flu, so we're talking 12 years ago now. Hello, fox lady. Oh, Dan Kelleher says that wasn't all of my bits, thankfully. That's good news. What just happened was resurrected. Thank you for answering that question. Achievement. Okay, we're back. In the East Forest. Now, we're not going to let this one beat the crap out of me this time. While I panic. And have sort of... The nice switch says, whoa, swine flu. I know, retro. I was so bored. I was, t I was just taking Tamiflu and just getting very bored. Um... It was properly retro, actually. Like, I, so my dad's a doctor, and at the time I wasn't living too far away from my parents' place. And he called me and he was like, oh, you sound a bit sick. And I was like, I am a bit sick. And he was like, hmm, this is suspicious. So he came over immediately um, with a lateral, well, not a lateral flow test, with a swab. Um, and then he went off. This was on a weekend, I think. He went off and managed to get it analysed and then rang me and was like, you have got... Swine. You've got swine flu, son. It's definitely swine flu. You're not allowed to leave the house for a week. I'm coming by with some Tammy flu. And I was like, that's great, pops. But, oh, I was rather planning... Oh, no, it wasn't a weekend. Uh, I was like, I was rather planning to go to Bestival this weekend. Um, the festival. And he was like, well, you can't. Um, and now, obviously... Now, obviously, I, I think about that and I'm like, yeah, that was that was the right thing to do. It's, you know, pandemic response, etc., etc., um, fair enough, father who works in immunology, I will stay home. At the time, I was like, but I don't even feel sick. Because I didn't. I had a little bit of a cold, but mostly I felt absolutely fucking fine. So I was a little bit peeved at missing out on festival, but there it is. <gasps> okay, alright, play it cool. Don't get killed. Because I want to see what happens when... This happens. Oh, that was a close run thing, wasn't it? My bits! Yes! What is this? Please be a potion bot. Oh, yes! Glug, glug, glug. That did not heal me very much at all. I assume it heals you up to the line. But, woof. Okay. Well, that sucked. Can we jumpeth? No. Okay. Well, what, what I might do then is go back down and then just go back to the bonfire statue thing and um, sort of heal myself up. Crafty Magpie says, right, back to the last lecture. Catch it on VOD later, but I really want to play it for myself. Have fun. Can't wait for Elden Ring Hotas. Oh, gosh. We are going to have to do Elden Ring Hotas, aren't we? It's the only way for me to stream it that isn't just identical to everybody else who's been streaming it. Oh, here we go. Yes. Oh, picking up your bits doesn't AOE, apparently. Thank you, Dan Kelleher. Right. Target lock. Face your adversaries. <laughs> Uh, focus and evade, focus and block. The weird thing I found is that doing it with left trigger, you have to keep left trigger held down like that. But just clicking the right stick keeps it locked on. Curious. Anyway, hero's grave is this way. Let's smash some pots because we're only human or vulpic, I suppose. And uh, let's go up here, see if we can find some some little secrets. Wow, you hit hard, but you telegraph your attacks very nicely. Can you ladders? No. Well, this is annoying. Oh, no. The uh, the potion does heal you a certain amount. Uh, 
Ow! I was watching the right hand when I should have been watching what the left hand was doing. Shit, they're bad. I'm guessing my ass kicked. Uh -oh. Nick and Jay saw a super chat saying. Uh, <laughs> Nick and Jay saw a super chat saying, Johnny, I love your channel, but if you play old guy's thing, I might die of overexposure. Yes, I kind of feel like it's a little bit everywhere at the moment, isn't it? It does do an AoE. Look at that. Come here, you nasty little guard people. Ho 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 ho. Honk honk. Oh, when I get a shield, it's over for you. It's over for you anyway, actually. What's in here? What's in here? What's in here? What's in here? Bits! Absolutely delightful. Hmm. Should we see what's in here? Looks temple-esque. Guardhouse 2. Guardhouse to what? Guardhouse to... I can't get through this yet. Oh, they're shrubs. It is a shrubbery. Okay. Well, let's push on to the hero's grave. Because... Foxes bloody love a bit of, of rummaging through uh, dead things. And taking stuff. Bins, graves, um, uh, gravy bins. You're big, aren't you? Fuck off. Ow, fuck off. Jesus. Sit down. Ow! Dickhead. Don't go in for two attacks, Johnny. Don't be greedy. There we go. Liam McClure has done a super chat saying, Celebrating my birthday with an 11-hour work day. Thank you for being my little bit of sanity. Leah, that sounds like a dreadful way to celebrate your birthday. Um, I hope you have a lovely one nonetheless. Um, glad to be here to provide uh, you with something to watch. But most importantly, I would like to say... Happy birthday to you. Have ah, have a lovely time. And I do hope that you uh, get spoiled rotten by your loved ones very soon. Oh, we're not, we're not in the best of shape, are we? Ah, oh shit! Do 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 do. We're just gonna cheese it. Basically, this is what foxes do a lot. They leg it. Woofed. Anonymous says, since the bushes are clearly sculpted, wouldn't they technically be topiaries? I don't know. I'm a fox with a stick on an adventure. What do I know about shrubberies and topiaries? Shadow Wolf Alpha 5 says, Hi Johnny, how are you today? I'm fine, thank you. I'm very well. Um, I'm struggling already in the warmer weather um, because this flat gets extremely hot. It was like, it can be like 15 degrees centigrade outside and it will be 26 in here. Um, and then when you add add to that the complication of, obviously, I, I've got two big computers running right now, one to stream and one to game. Uh, and they kick out a lot of heat in this very well insulated room. So uh, last summer I was playing video games in here and it was 35 degrees centigrade. So I'm slightly dreading all of that stuff starting up again. But hey ho. Oh, I was reading the ghost of Laura Palmer saying, I am a fox, I have a stick, I smack the things, they fall and twitch. Uh, and I lost my concentration, and now I think I'm in danger of die. Oh no, I've got a potion. Dying. I like this. This the combat feels a little chunkier than Death's Door, and I loved Death's Door. I still haven't finished it though. Might pick it up on the Switch. 
A Chartreuse Goose says, Is this game a quest for the fox to find the missing balls and cards from his bingo tournament? Which is such an, such an old school reference, I cannot help but respect it. Good work. There's a lot bigger reach on this stick than I initially realised. Not that big, but big enough. There we go. Ah, no. We have been defeated again by foliage. We cannot get to that chest. But we can get here. Secrets? Secrets? Cookie Cat 94 says, dog cooling mats are some of the best things for rooms that get too hot. Uh, put them on the back of the chair and enjoy not melting. That is an excellent point. Well, that was fun. Did it, what did it do? Oh, it lowered that thing. Right, understood. Ugh. Spudman 101 says, can you kite the sword dude to open the path by chopping the hedges? I wonder. I don't know. I'm already past it now, so I'll try and for Ah, well, it, you know what? It doesn't look like these are going to be a problem much longer. This statue looks incredibly sad. I found a sword! <sighs> oh yeah, I need to actually equip it, don't I? Oh, get out of my way, you little, little, I have become fox, scourge of the forest. I'm going to chop it all down. Ah. Meeple of Britain says, man, the UK really does need to invest in a better approach to air conditioning. Literally any approach to air conditioning would be a delight. And, uh... Arcadia says, Johnny, may I recommend a portable aircon unit? I got one. It saves me every year. Just throw the hose out the window. That's the plan. My wife and I are looking at them at the moment. Um, slightly dreading the implications with energy bills and stuff, but we just struggle so much. Now this is... Oh, no. I was going to say this is interesting. The sword now depletes my stamina, whereas the stick didn't, but that's just wrong. That's just wrong. Anyway, we're tottering around. God, there are so many little areas now that we can we can go visit. And I don't remember where any of them are. Oh, you didn't like that now, did you? The knockback on the sword! Oh, it's over for you lot. I'm your worst nightmare. Ah, Penguin Go... Oh, Penguin Gone Mad says, not sure who might need to know this, but Tunic has accessibility options. No fail mode, mode and unlimited stamina, so everyone can play the game regardless of how they are with combat. That's good. Hang on. Oh, fuck. Let's have a look. Accessibility. Vibration. You can change the vibration. You can reduce the screen shake and reduce the motion blur and reduce the damage flash. There is no fail mode and no stamina restrictions. That's great. So... If people are getting queasy, or if they're just finding the game a little too challenging, they can tweak it. That is nice. I, I like how, A, it feels like more games are exploring um, accessibility options, fuller accessibility options, rather. Uh, and I like how, how, more, how, how more we talk about it. I like how much uh, more common that conversation is becoming. Oh, look at that. I could have kited the sword dude to cut down the shrubbery. Um, it was good thinking. Whoever said that. Claire the Bear says, A fox with a blade. I'm your worst nightmare. Boop. There we go. That's so satisfying, that, isn't it? Anonymous says, you didn't like that, did you? How? To be fair, how would you enjoy someone swiping a sword at you? Not at all. Not at all. I don't... 
I'm not blaming them. I'm just saying they clearly didn't like it. Ah, we're back in the old guardhouse one, but now we're upstairs. And what's more? Oh, there's a shortcut now. What are you? <gasps> Broken bit of bottle, which I assume means we can find another bit. And, um, get another charge for the thing. Ooh, another charge for the potion bottle. Uh-oh, this seems bad. Right, excuse me one second. I'm just going to mute my mic for a sec because I've got something in my throat that is um, bothering me and I'm going to try and clear it, but I don't. you don't have to hear that. You don't have to put up with that, so give me a sec. All right, yeah, that's much better. Thank you. Um, oh, not potion bottle, piece of heart, says Dr. Branga. Garina Rain has done a super chat saying, After your stream the other week, I found that far loan sales and changing tides are on Switch. Lovely chill vibes until everything catches fire. Loving the Keep Fox stream, enjoying relaxing vibes. Thank you so much for the super chat, Garina. And, um, uh, that is, ah, what am I doing? Dying, apparently. Can we just leave? No, yes. Hmm. Hmm. Where is the nearest statue? Probably the other side of that, but... <laughs> Clay Sanford says, I like to imagine Johnny was just screaming the whole time. <laughs> um, Claire the best as I ordered my LSP shirt. It looks lush and was a bargain compared to the L NFL shirts I buy. Yes, uh... That was one of the founding sort of uh, principles of this channel is be less expensive than <laughs> the NFL. I think so far it's going it's going all right. Um, let's just go in and get whomped by the boss. We'll go in and get whomped by the boss, and then we'll just crack on with with health and a health charge. Or we'll just we'll we'll do a no hit run on this boss. Actually, why not? We'll do that. Yeah, that'll be nicer. Nailed it. Dang God, Captain! I love the aesthetic on this game so far. It has to be said, it is great. Where are we now? We're all the way back here. What? But we went to other statues. I thought that would have sort of brought us closer. Okay. Path to Hero's Grave. Ah! Right. I was going to Ian Higton this. Ow! Oh, no, we're not! Shit, we're going to get whomped in the face! Jiminy Crickets. And we've gone the wrong way. Okay, alright. There's an important lesson to be learned here, but damned if I'm going to learn it. Um, but yeah, if anyone is uh, looking to pick up a lovely Skeleton Pal t-shirt, uh, they are still available. They're available for like three more weeks, I think. Um, Carry Choice says, wrong way? I'm pretty sure I've gone the wrong way, yes. Um, but uh, I panicked, basically, and I ran. Um, yeah, there's a link in the description of this stream. The shirts are still available for a few weeks, and then they'll all get printed at the same time and shipped out. Um... And, uh, yeah, I hope you like them. So far, I wasn't able to access sales data at first for some unknown reason. But so far, uh, I would say I've, like, sold about 20 times more black shirts than white shirts. So, sort of, there's an exclusive white t-shirt club. Um, sort of, uh, just incidentally, um, sort of gathering. I'm also delighted to have sold one t-shirt to the Isle of Man. JP Corkery says, imagine learning from our mistakes. No thanks, JP. Where am I going? Guardhouse 2. But we don't want guard... I mean, we do want Guardhouse 2 now, don't we? Shield? 
bomb? I've got a bomb? Put that on Y. Okay. Dr. Branger says, Johnny, it's a shirt with goth skeleton stuff. Of course we're going to get it in black. I know, but I wanted to offer white to people as well. And so help me, they've taken it. I mean, we're going to bomb these lot, right? Oh, no, there's a fuse. Oh, but they're on fire now. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, I'm on fire now. It's okay. Stop, drop, and roll seems to work on foxes as well. Phew. Baddy wrong legs, sis. White t-shirt's about as popular as Discord light mode, then. Goodness. Ouch. I have gone entirely the wrong way, haven't I? But it's, um, it's nice. I'm having fun. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Ah! Surprise! Sp spoders! Sorry to anyone who is an arachnophob. Ah, oh, no, I died! So did they, though. Arcadia says, we'll be getting a couple of the t-shirts next week unless they run out. They can't run out, right? They cannot run out. Um, that is the good thing about, um, about Everpress is that they print as many as they sell, and only as many as they sell. So there's no wastage, but also um, there's no, like, stock updates or... Right. Let's let's do this properly. Hero's Grave. This, is that where we're going? Where are we going? <laughs> we've sort of been in this way. Well, we've been this way, and it took us to the... Oh, that's right. Yeah, you do take more damage when your stamina is out. Oh, no. It's a game where you have to have a sense of direction, at least to an extent, which is bad. The eight, the Atra lover says, I became addicted to the tunic the day it came out. I'm about 15 hours in, and I'm stuck at a boss I cannot beat. I've gone and done everything I can access. Maybe I should try Hotas. Always try hot ass. Always do it. Right. Guardhouse 1. Yes, I remember you. Eat it, little things that can't use a ladder. Okay, we have been hit, and that is bad. Oh, good. You can hear a, a vehicle reversing. I hope you all enjoy that. Really wish I'd kept my bombs now. Ow, this guy does not fuck about. Clear the ads, clear the ads, clear the ads, clear the ads. There we go, that's more like it. Oh, shit the bed. Don't get greedy. I miss... Uh... Uh, no, not misunderestimated. That's not a word. I underestimated that guy. Ah. Which is this way, though, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. I cannot tell you how ready I am for them to finish that construction work outside. I'm getting... Uh, very bored by it. The other day, I was editing a video in which I was apologi- Ow! Fuck off! I was apologising for somebody using a circular saw outside. Um, while somebody was use I was using a circular saw outside, so I was getting two circular swords. Ugh. Saws. Two circular saws going at, at once. Aha! Now I have a, a you killed me before bomb. Ha 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 ha! Oh yeah, don't spam roll. That is a good point. Because then I'll take fewer damage. Okay, chill, chill, Johnny. Chill those beans. You're in a commanding position. 
Ha ha! Suck it, that guy. Mr. Tree Man says, have you ever played Dragon Quest? I don't know that I have, actually. I don't think so. Um. Hmm. Shield? 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 Oops. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Eh, I'll take that. Bubble? Oh, it's so cute when he drinks. It's so cute when, when everything in this game. Hmm? Uh -huh. Carry choices. First try! Thank you for your support. Smash the pots. Oh! Ross Collins says, I feel like you've missed the benefits of whole day for travelling about, though. I can run! Look at me go! Look at, look at how my sword waggles. What do you have? A knife! No! Time for rolling. Bing! Ding! Rang the Eastern Bell. A bell's meant to do this! Ooh! Good luck or quit death has dropped a, a big old super chat. Uh, and in their usual style, they have said nothing. Oh my god, now it's a car horn! <laughs> we. That's a Lux Bell, says Cheerful Spider. What's one of those? Soma says, you should definitely play Divinity 2, the Dragon Knight Saga. It is incredible. One of the best games made. You play as a dragon. Do I need to say any more? I would love to watch you play it. Hmm. Intriguing. This might be slightly controversial. But I find dragons extremely boring. I do they do not excite me in any way, shape, or form. Sorry about that. Oh, I could lower the rope by the bell, says Cyborg Penguin. Well let's try that. Um Yeah, just not a fan of dragons. Or the band Imagine Dragons, because they're very existent. They're like, Imagine Dragons, and I'm there like No. Oh. Ha -ha. That looks like a piece of udon. Mr. McWaggle says reported, blocked, unsubscribed. And Tom B says, ah oh, man, don't spoil it. I don't know whether that's about this game or about dragons or, or what, but yep. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Hmm, interesting. Look at you all. Used to take three, sometimes even four hits with a stick to dispatch you before. Now look at me. I'm practically unstoppable. Claire de Bear says, Johnny, I'm part Welsh. How very dare you, lol. Not that dragon. That dragon's fine. Right, do we want to go this way? It looks nice. Oh, we've kind of been this way, haven't we? Oh, we can just open up the path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> Another page. Ah, oh, shit. 
Kindly die. There you go. Corvus Albright has done a super chat saying, Stabby wildlife haiku for stabby wildlife haiku time. Foxface does a stab. Look at the widow tail. It goes swish, swish, swish. I enjoyed that one. That was nice. Come here. I perfectly executed a special technique, apparently. Hmm. Why can't I pick this up? Ah, there we go. Okay. Hello. I am never going to be able to use this map properly. Oh, wait. I can see myself. I think. Oops. Oh, look. Slorm. A type of slime who wants to be close to you. Stun it by blocking. Auto bolt who wants to protect something. What? what? Circle around and use the shield. I do not have the shield right now. And that bothers me. Hmm. Oh, well. It'll turn up, I'm sure. Carl Moulton says, just joined, and good god, who gave the anthropomorphic fox a sword? I know. Whoops. Delightful. Aha! Will, will, will. If it isn't that place we've been. Captain Shiny says, that's a map I feel I couldn't use well. Same. 100% same. Also, I've forgotten how to zoom in. But oh well. Do we actually need to go this way? Not really. Ah! Shit! Okay. Let's go back that way. You know what? We could probably look at the fucking map to work out which way we're going. Sealed temple. Well. So it does seem to want us to go under the well. But will it give us the... Will it give us the... The shield? Let's go that way anyway. There we go. Zooming in is A. Thank you. Okie dokie. Gola says, Johnny, I think you've explained before, but is it possible to have larger sizes of the LSPTs? 3XL is as large as I was able to source. Um, uh, I can have a look at finding um, larger sizes than that as well. Um, but uh, so far, I've only been able to get up to 3XL. So, ooh, what is this? I can try, but right now, and fucking hell... Unfortunately not. It's a shop? I want to say? No, I don't... Oh, but 300 for a whole one. And what are these? 100 for those. Let's... Let's get another health potion. Oh, we can afford everything. Great. We've got a firecracker. Big scally pal. As good looker or quick death says. Claire de Bear says, Mummy Bears say language, Johnny. Ah, yes. When I... When I said I hope I don't say anything objectionable, um, what I really should have says, what, said was, I curse like a sailor. <laughs> um, it's just... It's just a little something about me. I have a foul mouth. Corvus Albright says, Johnny Dearest, what about LSP banana hammocks? Um, those aren't on my list of priorities for merch, but I appreciate the question nonetheless. Okay. Well, well, well. Old house sounds nice. Should we go to the old house?
Ow! Ah. <laughs> now I'm assuming we don't have the key to this. Dang. Chaos says LSP jorts when over my dead body, Kay. Over my dead body. Okay. Evade. Moment of safety. Damage taken? 100%. Block? Yes. Stability? Normal. Special tech? Yes. Low stamina. Vulnerable. Damage taken? 150%. Block? No. Stability? Low. Special tech? No. Okay. Basically... Ah, you got invulnerability. Check for dust. This is so... This is gorgeous, isn't it? <gasps> Treasures and tools. Hot pepper slash ivy. Effigy. Lure. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Uh, magic potion. Magic items. Cool. Cookie Cat 94 says, what about jandals? What are jandals? Jort candles? Jean candles? Kevin Moore says, would you like a general UI slash combat hint that took me almost nine hours to learn? Yes, please. That sounds nice. Emma Blast says, LSP... LSP jorts over your dead body. Your funeral is going to look weird. Yep, and I'm, I'm not sorry about it. Jandals are jean sandals. Quack. <laughs> I feel like I'm sort of getting into the swing of things with combat now. <laughs> swing. Oh my god! No, I'm not! Shit. Glug, glug, glug. Alright. Just want to find the key to the old house, mate. Gench coat. Nick Jeffrey has done a super chat saying, I too have a foul mouth. Chicken, goose, duck. Very good. LSP blanket. That's, that'd be fun. I'd need to talk to the artist who did the t-shirt design, so we kind of just talked about it being a t-shirt design, but if I could get it on a blanket, that would be good fun. We'll see. Do a deal with Udi for an LSP weighted blanket. The thing, like, actually, I'm, I mean, it's not, it's not how sponsorships work. Like, they can't, you have a shield, give it to me. It's not how sponsorships work. Like They can't force me to be sponsored by them. Uh, now that I'm running my own business. I didn't always have a say in what we were sponsored by at uh, Dicebreaker or Eurogamer. But most of the time I did. Give me your shield. Damn you. Um, I'm terrified of being sponsored by OD. Because I run I run hot generally. Like, I, I, I like the cold. I don't really need to layer up that often. And those things look incredibly warm. Uh, and I'm just terrified of, of trying to stream in one and passing out. They'll be like, hey, this July, could you stream in an UD? And I'll be like, sure. And then I will just die. Uh, oh, Kevin Moore says, when you're locked onto an enemy, a white bar located under the health starts fill filling each time you hit them. When this bar fills, they're briefly stunned. Nice. Okay. Good, good, good. Dr. Branga says, really? I thought you wanted to be sponsored by Random Soda. I mean, that would be good fun. What is this? Oh! I'm a strong little fox. Ah! An ambush. Oh, we're back here. Nice, nice, nice. A chest. Treats. Please give me a shield. I want one. Yeah. Ta-na. Ta-na. Ta-da. Ta-na. What does that mean? Lou 
Lucy is in the chat. Says hi, Johnny. Hi, everyone. Hello. I hope you're well. Martin C says, I want to be sponsored by the concept of baked beans. Not a brand of beans, just the concept. <laughs> I can I can dig it. Right, we've definitely been here before, haven't we? Hero's Grave is that way, yes. Right, okay. The nice switch says, Johnny goes to bed feeling grateful they got through another day without an email from Udi, but fearful that tomorrow will be the day. You don't know the half of it, mate. Every time I put on a jumper, I, I have to check to make sure it's not actually an Udi in, in disguise. And that I'm, I'm actually streaming without realising it. There's a... Ooh, look at that. All the way down the squares, there is a question mark. Is that where I started the game, though? I don't think it is. We're going to go have a look, because why not? JP Corkery says, Udi gets us all in the end. Yeah, this is where we started, isn't it? Trot, 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 trot. Whee! Ah, Black Shield Forge has uh, done a super chat saying, Hi all, I return from the Sky Forge of Yorvaskar in time for a stream. Hope everyone is safe and well on this sunny day. I went a, went a bit like a vampire there at the end, but uh, hello, Black Shield Forge. It's good to see you. I hope you are well. Um, da -da 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 -da. Can we get in here? No. Nick and Jay says, I want to be sponsored by Step 1. Love bamboo underwear marketed for larger gentlemen as well as small ones. Um... Yeah, look, it's it's happening. Everyone, drop your um your sponsorship wish lists here, and we'll get in touch with all the companies. We'll all be sponsored by tomorrow. You have my word, unless it's an Udi, because if I, I'm scared to talk to them in case they notice me, like putting on the eye, eye of Sauron, putting on the eye of Sauron, putting on the ring, and having the eye of Sauron notice me. Really doing well today at stringing stuff together. Right, where are we, where are we now? We're over here. Do we want to go to the East Forest? Probably. Is that where we want to... Let's go to the... Because we've got a checklist, haven't we? This is so cute. Okay. We have done the guard captain. Oh, the East Forest. Wait, did we ring... We rang it, but... I don't know what I'm doing. Corey Hayne says, what's going on with Udi's? Nothing, like, nothing sinister. It's just that, like, they keep sponsoring people and they just look like incredibly warm things and I would worry about boiling myself alive. Kevin Moore says, don't wear an Udi. You never know who has the others. They're like palantirs. An Udi is a dangerous tool, Saruman. Corvus Albright says, obviously, a, Jägermeister, a sponsorship from Jägermeister should be on this list. Oh, goodness. Right, yeah, look, we rang this, Johnny. What is wrong with you? Come on, you came down this way. You had a great time. We all had a laugh. Emily Hill has done a super chat saying, Johnny, have to go to work now, but I'm leaving your stream on for my dog, Boba Fetch. He is always so cosy during your streams. Me too, with a little heart emote. Thank you very much. Right, the West Bell. We need to find it. And once we're sure... Bell, t bell Tower, that sounds good. Should we go to the Bell Tower? Bell Tower, right, Bell Tower, great. Once we're sure Emily's gone, we can start talking to the dog and indoctrinate it into some sort of weird uh, dog thing. I don't know. Um, just give it instructions of mischievous things to do in the night. Unravel all of the toilet rolls. Swap the toaster and the kettle. It'll confuse them. Chris Rakowski has done a super chat saying, I heard that a uni archery club approached Strongbow for sponsorship, but they responded saying that we don't want to be associated with your sport. It made me laugh lots. Wow. That's impressive. Um, that's hilarious. CookieCat94 has done a super chat saying, I was confident I could will win the duel until the opponent sung his sword at my ankles. Alas, I was defeated. 
Oh, cookie cats. Goodness me. Okay, so we want to kind of go... We want to go down. Oh, shit. Whoa. Stop messing around, Johnny. There we go. We want to go down. Corey Haynes says, Hey, Johnny, random question. What did you take for A-levels? Because I'm stressed AF about mine. I did uh, English, Literature and Language, um, History and Politics. So all essay subjects. Um... I also did Spanish uh, at AS level, but um, uh, I dropped it because I wasn't great at it, and I thought, I'll just focus on the other three, please. And that was enough to get me into university, which was nice. The map says this bit's intact, but it's not. Ugh. Um, well, now I feel like a ninny. Oh, but wait, if we go up and up, then possibly over. Um, but yeah, I my A-levels felt like a lot. Like, as I'm sure you're feeling now, I was very aware that they, they were kind of... They felt very arbitrary, but they were also... They also had huge implications for the future of my life, that sort of thing. Which felt weird, um, but I got through them. Soma says, if you're on any of the discords, P, uh, ping me and we can talk about it, which is kind. Okay, so... Is this thing again? The big cheese square? Sorry, I keep checking the map obsessively now, but I'm finding I can actually read it, and that's quite comforting. But where do we want to go? I mean, I know where we want to go, but how do we get there? Hello, this looks good. Whatever this is. What are you, glowing place? Do you have a shield for me? Ta-da! It's flowers. And I've said ta-da again. That's not... It's dana or ta-da, Johnny. Ta-da! <laughs> Oh, no. Right. A Pom Pom says, Got my first tattoo today and I already want another one. Uh, congratulations on getting through it. I uh, hope it heals well. Cling clong. Corey Haynes says, how do I access the Discord? Sorry, is that a patron thing? Uh, yeah, it is. Uh... Oh, 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 I've heard about you. Shit. That was a lot. <laughs> um, damn it. Yeah, so uh, it's basically accessing the Patreon is the, the cheapest tier will get you in. And... Um, to be honest with you, a lot of the time, I mean, there have been quite a few people who have uh, signed up to pay me three quid a month and then their payments have lapsed and they've not been removed from the Discord because, whoops. Um, so, I'm not, it's bad business practice for me to say basically sign up and you can just quit and you'll still get the benefit, but um, that is technically true. Oh, shit. Pay attention, Johnny. I am a good business person. Oh, Abadosin Chulak 2 says, I don't think you can kill those. I just want to find the shield, frankly. I mean, I am having a lovely time. And you know what? Not every game needs a perfectly highlighted golden path to the next thing. It's all right. It's okay that I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to be going. So I'm still making some pro uh, progress. Dan Keller says, if it's any consolation, there's a nails enemy just past that one, so it's not worth getting past it. Okay. Apparently you can kill the turrets. Okay. That's good to know. 
You can, but you need the shield. Yeah, that, that makes sense, doesn't it? Okay, I'm going to ask in a French accent here, which, of course, uh, as anyone who's watched the streams before uh, will know, that is how I, I, I genuinely ask for advice, rather than just saying things out loud um, for my own benefit. So, where am I supposed to be going? Where do I find the shield? Where is the shield? Thank you. I heard the fox will look towards your next objective, like Link in Wind Waker. What? Cool. Um, Timothy Thomas has done a super chat saying, Hey, Johnny and LSPs, after a really high anxiety day, this is just what I need, Johnny. A beer and some mini eggs. Oh, this is just what I need. Johnny, a beer and some mini eggs. Mini eggs are fantastic, in fairness. Right, fox, I wish for you to look toward the objective. Fox, head south on the map from where you are, says Cyborg Penguin. Thank you. The shield's in the locked house, but I need to head south. Okay. <laughs> it's just north of the Stick Cave and Opening Beach. Okay. So, so south on the map from where I am, but I can go round to get there, I guess. The beach bus has the key for the old house. Okay. Ue le progress. Ue le progress. Okay. Can we do a backstab? Sort of. That worked quite well, actually. Oh, he blocked me! The cad. The bounder. Stamina. There we go. We'll have a little tickle. There is a checklist on the first page of the manual. There is. But God, so ring the east bell. La, la, la. Old house, flooded well, dark tomb, west garden. But yeah, okay. Oh, look, there's the key. There it was all along. Okay. That did not go anywhere near as far as I hoped. Oh, my stamina is low. Oh, man, a shield one from, from the rear. How do you like me now, lads? Ah! I don't... I don't like the turret fellow at all. Okay, here we go now. Here we go. Have a little tickle. If in doubt, with bombs. We've got the key, everyone. Thank you. Merci pour le guidance. Oh, Johnny, 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 no, you've got bad stamina. You need nice stamina. Assistance would have been better. When we were playing Love Letter in French the other day, we were playing with a version that has different names for the cards, and one of them was the Clown. Uh, so the best we could come up with was Lom Ki Ri, which is the man who laughs. It was weird, but in our defense, we'd had some wines. Smash! No, oh, I fire projectiles. You're going to be in so much trouble when I get that shield out of the old house. You again? No, don't lock onto those ones. Lock onto... Yep. <laughs> Chaos says, Honestly, I'm amazed at how well you're doing. Wait, this is with a Hotas, right? Uh, no. Sorry. Ruthie Pinion. Oh, with a, uh, an absolutely classic reference. Says, Je suis Lank. Salut! Je suis Lank. J'adore la princesse. 
Je suis un héros. What kind of hero was this? One gold? Nonsense. Ooh. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Was the beat about to drop then? No, oh, it's not. It doesn't go that hard. Garina says, a bit headachey. Gonna catch the rest on VOD. Have a great rest of the stream and day, everyone. Take care. I hope you feel better very, very soon. Looks like we're going off to a nightclub, so that's probably... It's probably for the best that you're taking a break for now. Oh, no, wait. Yes! Looks like he's giving it a little sniff. <laughs> Up goes the gate. And we're off. <laughs> We're off, they said, rolling into a door. Emma Benton says, what is happening? That's a great question, Emma Benton. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. What's in the chest? A tooth. Bastards, bastards, bastards. Ha! I defeated you with a sword and a shield. Peter Fisher says, Have you played Star Wars Jabba's Palace, a love letter game? I have not, Peter. But that sounds wild. There was a plan, actually, at one point for me, uh, when I was a dicebreaker, to review all of the love letters. Uh, but it never came to fruition. Uh, because uh, the pandemic made it quite difficult to play games with people in the same room. Which was a challenge for a board games website. I always thought it would be funny. Cheerful Spider says, oh, is this a sequel to Inscription? Well, a good number of you start chanting teeth, 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 which I can absolutely respect. Oh yeah, I've got a shield now. Ah. That was fun. What's this say? Hmm. It's weird. <gasps> Hot chili pepper. I don't know what it does. But we're going to bind it to B and we're going to try one. Does it aid stamina recovery? I have no idea. More flour. You know, we could probably look at this thing and see what they do. Hot pepper slash ivy. Something something at SP. We'll work it out. Oh, up there looks fun. Looks very shiny. I am now a spicy fox. You're damn right I am. Where am I on the map? Where is me? Oh, there I Look at all the... I'm all the way up here, look. Wow. Unfortunately, I don't think we can get through. Nick Jeffrey says, I have Lovecraft letter. I like it, but I am mad. Yeah, Lovecraft was big on the idea of the old capital M madness, wasn't he? Boop. Do, do, do. I, I mean, I'm just adorable. And the fox isn't bad either. Ah, this looks ominous. And we have no health left. This will go well. Uh, no potions left, rather. Dark Tomb. I'll say it is. Oh, this was a bad plan. This was an extremely bad idea. I hope I can find my way out again, because... Ouch. I'm gonna die. 
Wait, it's you lot. Oh, no, no. I rebound my sword button to be eat a hot pepper. So, whoops. That did not go well. Offer? Oh, I can offer these things. Oh, it's a shrine to get more uh, things. You know, bits. Whatever they're called. No. Okay. Okay. All right. Which way are we going now? Let's have a look at that. I wish you could turn it the other way to look at the front page, but there we go. Old house, flooded well. Dark tomb and west garden. So we're here. We've done the old house. West garden is to the west. Well done. The well. Oh yeah, the well. Well, let's see if we can go to the well. Let's go to the old well. Ruthie Pinion says, betrayed by your own community, much like in the Mario Kart stream. Oh, it still hurts. Okay. But how do we get to the well? Well, well, well. Oh, might ask a question in a French accent in a minute. Dan Callagher says, can I tell you a shortcut, Johnny? Yes, Dan, please do. Old house, flooded well, dark team, West Garden. Gaming with Geezer says, says, did they ever find beer cans for the bin? Did I? Have a look at this. Have a look at this nonsense. Uh, those of you who are extremely confused, on Monday, this is what we painted in the painting stream. So if you ever if you ever don't tune into those because you're like, I don't really know much about painting miniatures and I'm not really into wargaming, don't worry. We just had a wild time while I glued geese onto a bin and made a little pizza box with a little pizza munching rat. So there we go. Bin geese. Richard Spear says, Johnny finally figures out key mechanic. Also, Johnny leaves. Where did where was I supposed to go? Wes? Finally figures out key mechanic. Yes. Oh, I also left. Oh, is in the the Yeah, offering. But I don't know how to I mean I'll sure I'll offer some things, but Offer. I'll offer it. Chaos says, Johnny, have you seen the new Blood Bowl boars? I have. They're delightful. I want that team. Your gift is accepted, maiden. Oh, okay. So I am leveling up. Okay, that's what that is. Oh. This is not I will get to 200, isn't it? That I will... I'm offering 200. Right. From the bonfire where you're starting, go down the stairs, bottom left, and go up slash left. You'll see a small waterfall. You can walk behind it to get to the bit where the dark cave is. Okay, cool. Oops. Yes. Okay. Oh, and hit points. Okay, got it. You also don't want to go into the dark temple yet. Keep following that path around, and it curls around to the dark well. Okay. Down the stairs, bottom left. Yep. And then go up slash left. You'll see a small waterfall. Up and left. Up and left. Is this where? Oh. But, uh, did I not go far enough? Far enough? Down. So we go down the stairs. You, you overestimated my ability to follow instructions, Dan. <laughs> Also, I just took a pasting for no good reason, then. Is it up and left this way? Don't go over the bridge, sorry. Uh, I've gone this way now. Hang on. Okay. So I'm... 
I mean, I'm now back at the old house. Oh, which... You were basically there when you went to the dark cave you died in. Yes, Cyborg Penguin. But do I know how to get back there? That's the question. Okay, so we don't go over this bridge. At the bottom of the stairs, go up. These stairs go up. Do -la -la -la. Not these. Oh, this. No, surely not this. I'm good at video games. The nice switch says, Johnny, have you tried following your heart? Yes, and look where it, look where we all ended up, the nice switch. Look what it got us. This channel, which is great, but I shall never be able to run for political office now. Just go down the first flight of stairs from the bonfire, not all the way down. Okay. Kevin Moore says, wait, was that a Vermintide reference? You know it. Okay. Okay, right. Blah, 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 blah. It was down the stairs, bottom left. Only the first set of stairs is hidden. Oh, it's hidden behind the trees! Literally here. <laughs> okay. What's in this? Oh, this this place. We've been this place before. Ah. Well, well, well. Okay, there's the there's the thing where we died. Do we try and run in and get our bits? Yes. Let's try it. This is a bad idea. See you later! Ah! We made it. <laughs> Oofed. Okay. Okay, right, from here, from here, Forbidden Pass, Dark Tomb, we sort of went up that way, Mountain Door, we want to go to the well, can we access the well via this bit? Is this the way to the well? That looks like, yep. Ah! Shit! Wow, that's bad. That's bad for me. That's extremely bad for my health. What? Shit. Well, the good news is I, I know at least know where I'm going now. We're getting there, look. I'm learning. Ah! No, 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 we're not going. What? What is this now? What is this now? <laughs> so many delicious secrets. I. Well, okay.
Yeah. Right. Oh yeah, we have bombs. Okay. You know what? Okay, so here's the thing. What we want to do is stay alive. <laughs> they said. No, Johnny, no. Why? God. <sighs> so, right. Let me explain myself, because I feel like I ought to. My plan there was to ignore the chest, because that's bait, and run around and basically throw a bomb at the turret. Hopefully you can see from what just transpired that that was my intention. I make no bones about the fact the execution was absolutely dreadful. I just want you to understand that was my intention. Good luck or a quick death says that turret killed me so many times. So at least it's not just me. And good luck or a quick death knows a thing or two about a quick death. Or good luck. <gasps> Did you see that? I can bloody shield bash. It looks like. Can I? Is that a thing I can do? It looked like it did a shield bash. No switch says so the plan was to, was to stay alive. Yeah, now you're getting it. Yeah. That was the idea. Okay. <laughs> I threw the bomb directly into the water. Okay, but look, look, look. And, but seriously, though, what? How do we, do we just avoid it? Do we just avoid it? Do we just avoid it? Because that went that went pretty well, apart from the bit where I went and threw the the bomb into the water and it went fizz and didn't go off. That bit was awful. I think I might just have to run. But I want what's in that chest. And uh and now all of those bits are next to the turret. Hmm. Oh, hello. Charlie MCR says, if I join your Patreon today, do I have to pay for the whole of March? Yeah, basically it will take, it'll take your, it, it, it takes your money immediately. That's not something I can change now. Um, and then it will re, it will charge you again at the start of next month. So I would say wait until next uh, wait until next month if you are worried about getting charged twice given that it is the 24th of, of March great news I died somewhere vaguely more accessible let's just run we'll run we'll just run Dr. Branger reminds me, it's just 20 bits, not all my bits. I know, but I like my bits. Don't clip that. Jog, jog, jog. Jog, jog, jog. Make these things pay for their insolence. Jog, jog, jog. Do a swift bit of murder. Avoid those ones. Take this one a bit more seriously, because it's got a shield. Okay, we're in. I did it again. I don't know how to, to, to actually make that happen, but... Sort of did a bonk. Sarah Burke says, Hi, Johnny. My sister is in chat. She is shy and might not say hi. Would you be willing to say hi to Mel? Hi, Mel! I hope you are well. Welcome to chat. Um, uh, I hope you're having a lovely day. I am a mischievous little fox getting my ass kicked by a gun. 
Well, how did that... Where? It just died. I mean, I'll take it, but... Mm. Not a scratch on me. Ah, then we got some bits. Lovely. Okay. I don't know why it died, but I'm I'm glad that it's gone. No. Come on. Pick it up. There we go. <gasps> okay. Ah, okay, so if you seek to increase your power, at death, hup, potion, blur, and blur. Good to know. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Health points. Okay. Health points are good. Echo of self. Garden knight. Try to be this strong. Look at me. I'm adorable. And here's the map again. Okay. is intriguing. Beneath the well. That's what we wanted. Ah, now. I've been warned about this thing. A slorm. Stun it by blocking. Thank you, tip. Wow, that worked great. Ah, <laughs> it exploded. That worked not great. Hmm. Hello, Slorm. Oh, I feel bad for them. Wow, who did this guard piss off to get this duty? Apparently, there's a shortcut bridge back at the entrance. All right. Well, I'll go, I'll go drop it then. Ruthie Pinion says, look at the slorm though, they are so cute. I do feel a little bit bad about brutalizing them, if I'm perfectly honest. Oh yeah, look, it's the windmill and the brodge. Good shout, Avidocian Chulak too. Let's get back down there. Bart Draper says, if Johnny thought that gun was hard, wait till they get to the mines. A mine. Well, I don't want to get to the mines. What we got? Ooh. <gasps> Some meth? What will that be? What will that upgrade? Ruthie Pinion says, can we be the lovely Slorm pals now? Had I not just just commissioned and launched t-shirts saying lovely skeleton pals, I would consider this. But, uh... Uh... We'll hold fire <laughs> on that for now. <gasps> yes. Dr. Brangar says, oh my god, I did my Gimli impression exactly in line with Johnny then. <laughs> Let's offer some drugs! The Chartreuse Goose says, the lovely Slorm pals and Johnny Fox Sardini. Please don't make this catch on. The t-shirts haven't even been printed yet. Oops. Okay. We need more bits. HC Bird says you can always make spin off t shirts. But it worked so hard for these ones. Come here, Slorm. I want to weaponize you against this guard. Never mind, the guard died. I'm sorry, Slorm. I feel bad for Slorm.
the lighting on this is lovely. It's like being in the pool at Centre Parks after dark. Under the well, la la la. Husher, a friendly bird that loves to eat slorms. Husher doesn't sound very friendly to me. Crabbo, or crabbit. Crabbo has a hard shell, but crabbit has pals. Envoy, more questions than answers. Okay. Frog's domain. Uh oh. The Night Witch says, come on, you know we have the memory of goldfish. Next week it will be the lovely Sephiroth pals or something. A very good point. Well made. The Night Witch also says, Sender Parks after dark sounds a bit mucky. It does, now you mention it. I'm sorry! Forgive me! Ow! Not sorry about this one. Uh-oh. Hmm. I don't want to go that way because I'm pretty sure that's a turret and I don't know how I beat the last one. Oh, that was scary. That was actually really quite menacing and I didn't like it. I'm getting out of the water. Ooh. Come on, then. Oh, that actually went fine. Except for the bit where it, it blew up and that was quite dangerous. Cool. No longer quite so deathly afraid of Tourette's. <gasps> Forgive me. Oh, God. I have done vile things. Oh no. Oh no. I'm sorry. Hmm. Well. <sighs> hmm. So here, this is the, where they, Shit! That hurt so much. Shit! Fuck. Okay, we're just gonna very softly, softly. Ooh. I can't fucking ow. Ah! Ah! Ow. Shit. That was awful. That was horrible so it was. Oft. Didn't like that at all. Kevin Moore says, friends! Mm-mm. Cripes. Apparently Mythbusters tested the memories of goldfish and they're quite good. There you go. Nick Jeffrey says, I'm going to say goodbye as I'm meeting up soon with my TTRPG club for some D&D. Have foxy fun, y'all. Uh, take care, Nick. I hope D&D goes very well. May you encounter things far less nightmarish than what we just saw. Because, wow. That was nasty. 
Soundtrack's nice. A, a little me carved out of radish. Ah! Naughty. Naughty, horrible flying skulls. Behave yourselves. Who's next? All of you! I did not... Did not bargain on that. Too many, in fact. Yeah. Ooh, what are these? Different bombs. All right. Oh, Mel has said, ooh, ooh. <laughs> hello. Welcome aboard. I think you'll find there are some nice people here. Weird ones, but nice ones. Hmm? This isn't what I was expecting. Okay, well, that there, that little blue b -b 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 blue object looks like a lantern, which I think we'll need. Lantern acquired. Oops. Well, how do I... How do I equip lantern? Oh, I guess I just... Oh, I equip it when I need it. Okay, never mind. Uh. Nathaniel Levy says, I wanted to thank you. Your streams have provided a much needed relief from life, especially in the recent months with my mum's health taking a turn for the worse, so thank you. Um, Nathaniel, I'm so sorry to hear that, but I'm very, very glad that the streams have been, um, have been of use. There we go, look. I'm a glowing little fox now. Da -da. Oh, come on, they're just having lunch. Must we? I don't feel good about this. Ow. Honestly, I respect your right to defend yourselves. Because I'm attack literally attacking you, not like in a I'm rabid about gun ownership sort of way. Abadosian like 2 says the lighting from the lantern is gorgeous, isn't it? This game is just so Oh, it's lovely. Oh, hello. Mm. And beneath the earth. What? Oh, good. Is that what had the tentacles? Because if so, I'm out. That's horrible. <laughs> Anonymous says, close your heart to their suffering. Boy. Fair point. Dark Tomb. Oh, it's a map to Dark Tomb. Under the well and under the earth. Okay. Oh. May we? May we? What does this one do again? Uh, the thing will tell us. Or at least it should do. Ah, here we go. Hmm, I don't know. So let's see. Let's offer. Bing! Death. <gasps> the lighting is is lovely. Ismail Melemes, I've almost certainly mispronounced that. Please forgive me. Uh, uh oh, now we're in the dark tomb. Uh, says the art style really is. Hades like, but I thought this was available in English. Is Johnny using the Chinese version? No, this is that basically that is a fictional runic script. Um but it does contain English, so like um Yeah. 
So, excuse me, why am I yawning? All right, here we go. I can see you now. Wow, you're not so scary at all. I mean, you're quite scary, but... Sorry for biffing what looked quite a lot like you all, chat. Ha <laughs> ha you froze. Oh, no. It doesn't damage, it just freezes. Well, that's good to know. I should have locked on there, really. Hmm. It seems trap-like. Oh! You hit hard. But I hit harder. Well, just more frequently, I guess. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Ow! There we go. Sarah Burke says, Oh no, more skelly ouches. Sorry. Ah, this, this lot again. Take that. Okay. And then there was something I could interact with. Was that a good idea? Inquiring minds would like to know. Also, how get up here? I am fox. I cannot climb. Okay, well, let's consult the map, shall we? Yep, I have no idea. Okay, so that, that is where I am. Oh, it looks like this room might be enormous. Yes. Ah, f mining muffmana. You nasty little sods. Come down here. Oh, I'll, I'll come up to you. Okay, you stay there now. All right. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Realized I made a lot of noises then and didn't explain a single one of them. Um. Oh, look, there's another skull to light up. Okay. See, the problem with being a skeleton is that when you start combat, you have to sort of assemble yourself. And I think oftentimes, uh, that gives people enough time to murder you. So, the reason I went, oh, is because I realised from the map that that stone was covering an entryway. And the good news is now, we can just bimble up here. This is moved, so we can just open it. I said so we ah there we go uh, what is this what was that is it does it go into the instruction booklet <gasps> no wait we've already seen that bit <laughs> Ah, the frog's domain looks adorable. I'm very keen to go there. A baby slum who cannot spin yet, but is still useful. Hmm. Well, that's darling. Other sides, Johnny. Other side of what? Oh, the other side of the chest. Yes. Baby Slorm. Uh, we're going to destroy so many of them and I'm not going to feel good about it. Speaking of destroying things, here are some pots. Hmm. This looks 
dangerous. Hmm. Ah, oh, well, this looks awful. Ha <laughs> trap damage. Good, another thing. Oh, yeah! Honk honk, we've got another potion. Well, I'm going to clear this room of skeletons, and then I think we should take a little break, shouldn't we? Because we've been going for about two hours. I'm out of water and my throat's a little scratchy, which is only mildly worrying. Um... <laughs> and uh, it may be that you are also in need of, ow, say refreshment or ow, uh, or perhaps you are too warm or too cold or you need to stretch or there's something you need to do that you can take care of in five to seven minutes, you know, just normal stuff that you can do when you're on, uh, you're watching a live stream, but the live stream's on a five to seven minute break. Um, if you aren't going anywhere, cool, that's great, respect your choice, love that for you, very comfortable where you are. I will show uh, on screen a picture of my dog and there will be some smooth jazz accompanying it. Um, so that will be nice. Um, if you were... Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, if you also wanted to check out the lovely Skeleton Pal t-shirts, you can do so by finding the... Um, um, Link in the description of this stream. Right, so... Whoa, whoa, I mean, there's me yawning, so I should take a break. Um, right. I'll see you in five to seven minutes. Um, so, uh, and I'll see you back here. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Five to seven minute break. You know the drill. See you back here. Take care of yourselves. Uh, be right back.
Well, hi there, everybody, and welcome back to this um, little live stream here on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiannini. Hmm. That's me. I hope you're well. Um, especially if you're just joining from um, from uh, <coughs> Ellen Souls Academy. I appreciate that has just ended. So, what is wrong with the cameras today? Do I need to change that setting? Or do I just look haggard? Why not both? Anyway, mm, I look a little less pallid. Anyway, um, less about my face. We've got uh, two super chats. Well, one super chat and one super sticker to get through, and then we're going to get back to the absolutely delightful tunic. Alex Campbell, just before the break, says, Johnny, you are a delight, even when you're just yelling and swearing at the screen. Have a bevy on me. Thank you very much, Alex. Um, swearing and yelling at the screen um, is kind of just my natural state of being, so I'm extremely glad that people enjoy it because there's no way I can change it. Silent Cobb, meanwhile, has done a super sticker of a Shiba Inu. A Shiba Inu is a dog. Um, it is a primitive breed. Um, it's quite cute. It looks like a little fox, but it's got like a little bottlenose dolphin nose snout thing going on. Um, typically speaking, they aren't trained in martial arts, but this one is because it's standing up in what looks like a fairly standard sort of like uh, front stance, uh, and it's sort of just doing repeated punches while wearing a, a band, a white band with um, the rising sun in the middle. Um, so yeah, that's just, that is a, a martial arts Shiba Inu, which, you know what, looks, um, it's, it's pretty bang on for this game in which we play as a lovely, lovely violent fox. So, um, we are um, in the dark dungeon, as you might have been able to tell from the darkness and the dungeon-ness. Not Dungeness, that's a place in the UK, but um, the fact that it is a dungeon. Um, we've just actually explored this bit. I'm just getting my bearings again. Um, yeah, I think we can just leave this room. But this is a bloody delightful game in which you are a fox who has opposable thumbs and thus can command the use of a sword, a shield, bombs, a potion bottle. Many other things that you know you might need in order to be an adventurer, which is a uh, ah yes that's right this room it looks horrible. How do we get down there though? That's my question. God, it looks awful this bit. Also, if you'll forgive me, um, during the break I made myself a little sandwich, um, and I have one bite left, but I was conscious of the fact that I hadn't. Um, that the break was running long, and I was like, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll eat that later. But the idea that there's going to be a tiny bit of toasted sandwich sat there on my desk for two hours is very odd. So I'm going to mute my mic, but I'm going to, um, going to eat it now, and then we can crack on with our lives. All done, thank you. Um, it was um, a corn ham sandwich. So quite boring. Ho ho ho! Oh gosh. Ah, great. You're just. Ah, oh, good. Luna's come to say hello. Um, but yeah, uh, it was. It was just corn ham. It's a bit of vegan ham in a sandwich. It was, quite, it was quite bland, but also quite tasty. Now, ideally, we want to aggro this... Aggro! want to aggro one of these enemies. Christ. Yeah, yes! That's what we want. And we'll smash these out of the way. This is a delight. I'm bloody loving this. It was not a tuna and chili mayonnaise sandwich for anyone who was asking. I'm not telling that story again today. It's already been told twice. It has been clipped. It's well documented. 
This is a dark dungeon. A. Hey, whoa! I found a Quan. Was this a secret? I think it was just a secret. Onwards then. Oh, wow. It feels like a shame to smash all these up. So I feel like there's going to be an enemy that I'm going to want to cheese with the turrets, but here we are. <gasps> that is adorable! And I've seen this before in the thing. What is it? This, this menu thing is so good. Effigy! Good. Was that there before? The sort of like handwritten annotations? God, this is nice. I love this. Hmm. Stephen Paul says, my, cl my clock is screwed up because of daylight savings. Johnny used to start at 10 here, now they start at 11. Uh, only for a couple more days, I think, because our clocks are going forward. So, it, sh it should be back to normal, I think. Ooh. <gasps> Charlie MC asks, is squeaky bean pastrami as good as, if not better than, the dead animal? Squeaky bean pastrami is absolutely amazing. There are lots of good vegan fake meats, but that one, oh, it's so good. Okay. Hmm. We'll push on. It doesn't seem like we can get to that ladder just yet, much as I'd like to. Oh, we're outside again. Delightful. Oh, Well, that looks like the thing we need to hit to make go bong. So that's nice. West Garden. Yeah, is that where we need to be going? Dark Team West Garden. Great. Jesse Belanga says, hey all, tattoo in progress. This is a lovely distraction. Um, yeah, uh, like I say, keep your blood sugars up. Uh, glad to be able to distract you. Say hi to your artist for me. <laughs> all right. That tree is lovely. I like how its roots are very right angled. This is much nicer than the dark dungeon. What's over this way? Let's have a look. Ooh, ah! Don't know what that thing is, but it seems horrible, so. Oh, but there was a bonfire that way, so that's nice. Soundtrack feels very death door now. Boop, boop. Can we get up here? Secrets? Secrets? Where am I going? Aha, aha. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> I'm not a smart person. Casual reminder that my pronouns are they, them, not he, him. Here lies the hero. Yeah. Um, no, 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 West Garden. Do we have anything about the West Garden yet? Oh, God. Let's just keep, we'll keep wandering around for now. I really must stop exhausting my stamina. It's not fair on the fox. And I can sprint. And that's free. So I don't know why I'm rolling everywhere. West Garden. 
Okay, right. Let's try all this again. Where is that telescope? My sense of direction is so bad. Okay, here's the telescope. Getting over there would be nice if we can manage it. Where was the secret path? Was there one? Am I imagining things? What has happened to me? Oh, we can go over this thing, can't we? That's more like it. Aha! There we go. Made it. And that's a bridge we can drop later. Ta-da! Let's see what we can offer up. We can up our def, we can up our hoop. Can we afford both? Two fit no. Oh, only twenty bits short. Oh well. B Muzzer says gotta go eat some tucker now. Veggie green curry om nom nom. Have a lovely evening, folks. Take care, B Muzzer. I hope your veggie green curry is absolutely delicious. Boop. More hip punts. That's a well. We've already been under the well. Ooh, steady. Mm, can't go that way. Another page of the manual. I love that it's dotted around like that. And that it's such a lovely, like, artifact, almost. Ow! There you go. Have some of that. You big crocodile looking motherfucker. Okay. Keep an eye on your bars. Use your items. Use special techniques. Tired all the time? Yes. Oh, that I need that on a t shirt. Hold A. This thing. Which I still don't quite understand. And do check the map. Okay, but we want to look at page 20. But we don't have page 20 yet. <gasps> Aww. Oh, it's called a chomping nom. A chomping nom. Which sounds like... Almost like the French word for mushroom, but isn't. Oh. Boss? Blocks the way to the bell tower will kill you. Great. Rudling. Oh, ghost of a soldier who's forgotten why they fight, follows orders but has no soul. Fairies, magic dagger, ringing the west bell, west garden, then dark tomb again. But, oh my god, the chomping nom. Absolutely delightful. I love this. I love this so much. It is great. Chomping nom. Right, so which way do we want to go? Oopsie. Ah! Ah. Goodness me. Okay. Trot, trot, trot. I am a fox. Who wants to get a sword in the face? Hmm. Where to? Where to? Who are eh? Le progress. Je ne sais. Pa. <laughs> hmm. How do we get up there? Hmm. 
Because this is sort of just all the way back, isn't it? Oh, but then, but then, but we want to get up there. How do we get up there? is here. West Garden, Bell Tower. Hmm. I'm a little turned around. If anybody does know, which way should I be going, please? <sighs> Buddy Wrongleg says, this is, is this at all related to Death's Door? I've heard you make comparisons, but it has very similar, similar visual vibes. I don't think so, but yeah. Um, oh, goodness. Dog got excited and honked like a goose in the background there. Can't be good for the dog. I think I'm probably going the wrong way, but... Go to where the, sh the chomping numb was. Jumping numb. Says Bart D. All right. West, you have to go the long way to the tower, so it's good luck or a quick death. Okay. Oh, uh, there was a felled pillar where I fought the chomping numb, over which I can run. Cool. Back to chomp, Mist Bridge, says Whoopsie Daisy. Thank you very much, all of you. Of course, now I have to remember where I fought it. Or I can just look for the pillar. Was it sort of around here? I'm just going to keep exploring now. Aha! There we go. Lovely, lovely bit of business. What? Oh. Look at the fish in the water. They said just as all the fish in the water disappeared. Watch this on catch up and look at the fish in the water. Hello. Ooh. Delightful. Bunch of bits. Means that next time we find a bonfire, we should be able to upgrade our hoop again. Or our death. Depends how we're feeling, I suppose. Great. All right. We're making progress. This is absolutely glorious. Rob C. says, so this game is a secret Dark Souls sequel, right? Yes. Welcome. It's Elden Ring. Time for rolling. Is this a secret item? Ho, 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 try finger, etc., etc. Well, 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 if it isn't a shortcut. <laughs> That's some sort of berry. Anyone getting up there? Soma says a stamina upgrade wouldn't go amiss. Uh, yeah, I'm inclined to agree with you, actually. Let's give that a go. I do seem to run out of puff quite quickly. Let's just keep exploring. Huh? No, that's it. Vulpen ring, says Aiden folks. Yes, please. I enjoyed that. That was good. Ah! Oh, God, it's... Ah, no, don't do that again, Johnny. That's terrible when you do that. Sorry, Chomping Nom. <gasps> Why am I being attacked by the ghosts from Destiny? That fox came from the moon. Ow! Shit! Don't forget your shield, then. Oofed. Yikes. That was rough. Ah! More of you. Eyes up, guardian. <laughs> Bar 
bastards. Okay. Oh, Emma Benson says they're mad because I'm not from the moon. Understood. Thank you. So fickle, the ghosts. Or fairies, as I believe they're called in this game. Let's see what's over here. We can't, because of isometric stuff. Are those bigger than the normal ones? Oh, wow. Uh, now run and heal or die. That's fine too. <laughs> Captain Crumbo says, judging by the fox cub in cub yeah, judging by the fox cubs in my garden, they normally have a fuck ton of stamina, so going to have to dock points for the unrealistic depiction of the protagonist. <laughs> well that was clumsy of me, wasn't it? How annoying. Okay. Do I have... Okay, I could upgrade my def. Which I think I'll do. Mr. McWangle says that was brutal. That was brutal. I hated it. Def. Three. Okay. Which way were we going? Where was that bridge that we got to drop? Again, stop rolling everywhere, Johnny. Yeah, that wasn't even the way to go. My sense of direction is just dreadful, isn't it? Look at me go. Bart D says, no worries, Johnny. I died like four times to that swarm. Okay. So I've got three deaths left. And then if I die more than four times to that swarm... I have to give Bart D my YouTube channel. I think that's how this works. I'm not entirely sure. The book said they are fast but bad at turning. Dodge when they lunge and then hit from the side, question mark, says Lucentheus. That's a good strat. Let's try it. First, I have to remember which... There we go. <laughs> Wait, I was going. And then I went this way? Pretty sure I went this way. You. Ooh, I didn't go this way. Because look. It's another bun or hollow, like a piggy bank thing. Effigy, anyway. Trot, trot, trot. I'm a small fox. Oh, fuck off. Ah, what? I was really hoping that would fire, fire back at the thing. Come here. Come here. I have only a sword. There we go. Take that. Mr. McWaggle says fuzzy slippers of your own head. <laughs> Butterscotch says, hey Johnny, joining late. How are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. Um, a little bit tired. I've had quite a busy week, but I'm uh, I'm enjoying this game very much. So that's nice. I'm just trying to remember where I was. Uh, this is not the way to go. This is the way we came in to this area. But then I did activate a shortcut. I'm lost is what I'm trying to tell you. Which is impressive. Even from me. But we'll get there. Oh, uh, There I am. Aha, aha, aha. Is this where we were? Honestly, just a staggeringly poor memory for where I've already been in video games. My sense of direction in real life is not bad. But, uh... Video games are a whole different kettle of fox. Yeah, well, we're back here now, and that's great and all, but... So we dropped this shortcut, and that's good. And we sort of... We went, already went there. 
I am so... Hmm. Help. If anybody is hearing this, please tell me which way to go. Let me go back up for a sec. Because what if? Nope. Do I have enough bits now to offer? No, I don't. Oh, no, not at all. Hmm. Angel Beat says, Good evening, what a cute little fox. Hello, Angel Beat. How are you? I hope you're well. It's good to see you in chat, as ever. I'm lost. Because I'm bad with uh, directions. Keep going south under the bridge. Okay. Thank you, good luck for a quick death. Aha! Thank you. Oh, yes, I remember. Oh, no, don't do it again! Johnny, no! Oh, Johnny. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Okay, now you're panicking. Quite badly, actually. Yes, rolling to the side of those guys is absolutely key. This is horrible. This is... Oh, this poor fox. What did it do to deserve this? I might be able to brute force my way through this. Nobody expected me to come out on top of that. Let's face it. Least of all me. That was preposterous. Ah! Oh, I wish I hadn't done that. Oh, you cowards! You cowards! You cowards and murderers! I'm just a fox! I'm a tiny, cute fox! And I'm running away. Because if I die, I want to die somewhere I can pick up my bits easily. You know what? That's stupid. That's a, that's a silly way to go about it. I mean, I seem to have just lost them. Which I'll absolutely take. That's great. Ah, yes, but of course... That wasn't even the bit that killed me last time. This bit was. And I think it's likely to do it again. Unless I can... Oh, I was going to say unless I can sneak. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, of course they, of course they got me. Okay, we go again. We go again. Right. Oh, okay, we're doing that, are we? Cool, thanks so much, computer mouse. I really wanted to change scene in OBS then. That was fun. But look, I know vaguely which way I'm going now, I think. <laughs> South under the bridge. Which is not this way. What is wrong with me? South under the bridge. South under the bridge. South under the bridge. South under the bridge. Good. Get out of it, you little ghost. Okay. Oh, I didn't see that bloody ghost there. Or fairy or whatever they want to call themselves. Ow! Are you shitting me? Have a little tickle. There we go. Bastards. 
bastards. Ah. Uh. I was ready for you that time, I said, getting shot twice and nearly dying. Oh, are you kidding? Oof. I mean, it feels like there's been a perfect intersection between the difficulty increasing a little bit and me being a little bit tired. But... Hopefully... Hey, don't be tired. Don't, don't fuck it up, Johnny. Fucked it up, didn't I? This is tricky. This is tricky. I take back what I said about giving away my channel if I died too many times to this thing. At least I remember the way now. South under the bridge. Fucking die. Oh, two of them. Two of the bastards. How did that hit me? I'm tilting full scale now, aren't I? I'm absolutely tilting. Alright, you know what? We're sacrificing those bits. Oh, what? Oh, I didn't realise I actually killed that thing. We're sacrificing those bits. We're going to chill. We're going to chill for a minute. We're just going to chill out. Don't forget to use items to even the odds, says Bart D. All right. Oh, we do have bombs. We had bombs. Well, now we're going to cause some problems for them. Okay, but we're still going to take a minute. Let's just take a minute. Let's shake it out. Let's shake it out. Oofed. Ah, just chill. It's fine. Am I tilting? Yes. Is Emma Benton rightly calling me out for egregious acts of hubris? Yes. Are we going to calm down? Yes. Are we going to do better once we've calmed down? Maybe. Oof. We're just going to chill. I'm going to... There we go. Stretch my neck out a little bit. Okay. Mr. McWaggle says, If you eat a chilli pepper, will you make yourself too spicy for them and therefore unappetising? I don't know, but I'd like to try it. Okay. That's the wrong way. Okay. Here we go. Sailing K says, you got this, Johnny. I believe in you. Thank you very much. Thunder Cookie has done a super sticker. Oh, this will chill me out. Uh, right. You'll remember earlier we discussed a pear um, and how a pear is normally a piece of fruit that is inanimate. Um, uh, and how sometimes, as in this case and the case earlier, pears can... Um, differ from the norm by having arms, legs, a face, um, uh, a liking of sport, which is just bizarre. Um, well, this, this is one of those such pairs. This pair has a sports headband on um, and has dumbbells and is sweating quite profusely while raising them and also raising alternate, alternating knees. So if its right arm is up, its left knee is up and then it swaps and swaps and swaps and swaps and it appears to be training to get strong. Possibly for, for, for combat purposes. I don't really know what this pair's deal is. But it's saying keep it up. Um, so thank you, Thunder Cookie, for the uh, the encouragement. From, uh, oh, don't do it again, Johnny. From, um... Thank you for the words of encouragement.
Oh. Again, what's your stamina? Do lock on. That helps as well. So now you know how close they are all to dying. And they have all died. Okay. Right. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I let them back off to an area where I can't hit them. And they can hit me. Ow! Oh, come now. And you're tired, so you're taking the extra damage. Johnny! Your shield is your friend. See? Come here. Thank you. We're still chill. We're still fine. We're still absolutely fine. Gonna have a little tickle. Why not? Captain Crimbo says of the pair, I feel like it's training to punch fascists. <laughs> Comrade pair. Okay. Right. Now here's what we do. We aggro them and we throw a bomb at them. Ah, they're all on fire now. But then I think I will be as well. Yes. Ah! Ho ho ho! Yay! Ah! We actually did it. But of course, will we survive in the next bit? Debatable. Oh, ooh. Secrets? Secrets. Ah, shit. No, leave off, lads. Come on. Another pepper. Okay. Ah, well, that was nice. That went well-ish. It didn't go very well at all, but we got through it. It's a decent number of bits. Fear my wrath, etc., etc. Oh, no! Come here. Oh, it's like the bloody moonlight butterfly. There we go. Hit it with a sword. Have some of that. Mmm. Bums. More bums. <laughs> bums. I don't know what that does. What does it do? I love it. Thunder Cookie says, Oh, what's the blue bits for? I think, I think there's magic in, uh, in this game. It's kind of like an MP system. But we haven't seen it yet. Cool, 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 cool. Now. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, well, I'd love a shortcut. I'd love one, actually. Oh, shit. That's not what I wanted at all. Oh, crap. I threw the bomb the wrong way as well. That was cheeky. Fucked it, didn't I? So near and yet so far. Ugh, frustrating. Frustrating. How am I doing on bits? 155. Oh, but I got nothing to offer anyway. Doesn't matter. Ping. <laughs> Everyone's saying it's one gold piece. Is this the right way? What am I doing? Brain's gone blank.
This way, here we go. Come on, Johnny, just use the... Captain Krimo says, Did you just get Ormstein and Smoud? It certainly feels like it, doesn't it? I took a lot of damage. I'm feeling slightly... Slightly ashamed of myself. I've still got ages to go to get back to the bloody place. Whoever designed that bus run... That ju I'm just getting completely unmanned by these bloody crocodile things. Chomping noms. Oh, rolling toward them doesn't hurt either. There we go. Oh, okay, alright. Fuck them, we can do it now. Ping. We'll have a tickle. Come here. Come here, you cowardly robot thing. Done. Apparently that's a right way, but it's not the fastest right way. Meh. It's the one I'm doing now. <laughs> Why can't I even get up that thing? Okay. What's up, lads? Ow. Oh, I mean, do do stay alive, though, Johnny. <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> I feel like I've I feel like I've got it cracked, but obviously that went dreadfully. Hmm. Nothing quite like dying and then watching your concurrence go boop a little bit. Anyway, right. We try again. Because failure is not just an option. It's a requirement. Come here, Dinklebot. There we go. Right. Oh, I would love a stamina upgrade, though. Ow. That was not pretty, but it worked. Okay. I'm a little robot, short and stout. I am an asshole. I fly about. When you hear me charging, I will shout. With a flask to spare. Definitely feel like I've got used to it now. Okay. Fucking forgot about this lot. Okay. All right, let's see where we are on the map now. Here. Okay. Just wondering which way to go. Oh, wait, that was just a thing, wasn't it? Okie dokie. Hello! 
Do you have time to talk about our Lord and Saviour? A sword. Sword and Saviour. <laughs> Hello. What is this? Okay. Great. Well, that's... I'm very glad we found that. Okay. Don't forget your stamina, Johnny. It's the most important bit. Okay. Well, now we're through that bottleneck, I'm having a lovely time again. Steve Gilly says, wait, the, the crocs are called chomping noms? I love them. I know, aren't they brilliant? Precious, precious little things. Hello! I think this is a magic dagger. Magic items. No, totally cross. <laughs> Magic points. Whoa! All right. That is what that is. That is what that is. Well done, me. The Nice Witch says time for me to dip. Take care, Skellies. Take care, the Nice Witch. It was lovely having you in chat as ever. Alexander Hansen says, Is this a magic dagger I see before me? It is. <laughs> now, that was delightful. Ah, oh, no, I got got by a bloody fairy, I think they're called. Oh, this is... That's bad. I'm in trouble. Yes, there we go. Uh, right. Wei Han Lim said, wish they had that during Hungover Mario Kart. <laughs> Ow! Shit. I wasn't paying attention. There we go. Uh. Ow! Christ on a bike! No! Not again! Okay. Phew. This, you know what? I can't remember who it was who said that this game is deceptively cute, but yeah. Oh, I think that might help increase our stamina. I've got 333. Yeah, look. I need 200 to... Hopefully up my stamina. I actually think it's worth going back and just doing it at the... Dr. Branger says, I do love the friendly fire with enemies. And Rudy says, that fairy helped you there. Yeah, it was really useful. Thankfully. Ah, oh, yes. More stamina. 
That means more rolling. Captain Crimbo says these lads are not foxing about. <laughs> meh, meh. Alright, let's try up here, shall we? It's just so pretty as well. <gasps> yes! Aha! We can drop another noodle. Which will take us to... <gasps> here! Oh, yes, please! Oh, that's a delight. Uh, why does this... F ah! That's why it feels boss-like. Garden Knight. Ah! Pardon? Okay, we have to watch out for that bit. I mean, gadzooks. Yes, no wonder. No wonder. Oops. Oh, well. Uh, is there anything I can... Ah, I can't quite afford that. I could go far. <laughs> Mr. McWaggle says, Oh no, a biblically, biblically accurate angel. Ah, oh, that's funny. Dan Keller says, yes, just killed the Garden Knight myself. Super tough. Yeah, I don't feel great about this. I'm not going to lie. I'm actually going to go back and then farm those three enemies again so we can do that upgrade. Oofed! Alexander Hansen says, I'm hearing Aoife's voice yelling stamina. It was never yelling. It was always just stamina. And she was never not right. Aoife knows best. Lock on, Johnny. There's a good fellow. Okay. Whoopsie. Uh, what's I doing? My at. Can I put up my at? Would it be a faster approach from the other shrine? What with the noodle shortcut? Yes, it would. Uh, Sailing K, I'm not going to lie. I kind of forgot that I was at a different... Shrine with the noodle shortcut. So yes, we should go back to that one. Oh, Lisa Hunt says it looks like you have piggy banks or foxy banks that you could you could break for more pips. Is that what those do? Well, that was not full of very much money, but I liked it. Oh, stop doing that, Johnny. Oh, oh, that's very pretty, but functionally useless right now. That was amazing. That was so cute. And then so violent. Um, 
I'm not going to lie, my sense of direction's gone sideways again, so I'm not entirely sure which way I am going. It's not that way. We've already been that way. <laughs> Cyborg Penguin says the little violence fox wants its money. <laughs> oh, the money increases every time you smash one of those. Well, that's good news. Ow! Bastard. Oops. Oh, I managed to deflect it that time. That's good. Right. Now. Let's find the other shrine. With the shortcut noodle. Here's the shortcut noodle. Yeah, and then there's the shrine back here. Cool, cool, cool. Wow. Okay, Steve Gilly says violent sword fox versus the Duolingo owl. Choose your warrior. Still the Duolingo owl. That thing is terrifying. Haven't done your Italian today, Johnny. You know what that means. Uh... Wait a minute. Where's the noodle gun? You see what? I, do you, can you imagine what it's like being me? Being like, yeah, I'll go do that thing, and then four seconds later, just but it's up here, isn't it? Is it here? There you are, noodle. Exhausting. Absolutely exhausting. Right. Let's go get our ass kicked again. Okay. Take that. That just hurts so much. I mean... My good fellow garden knight, come now. Oh, you're going to shoot several times, are you? Well, that went a lot better. Oh, God, Doom Biscuit says, what are the bets this monstrosity has more than one phase? I bet it does. I wouldn't, yeah. I, th that's my assumption, to be perfectly honest with you. Oofed. Right. Emma Benton says, biblically, biblically accurate angel smash doesn't roll off the tongue as well as Hulk smash, but what can you do? And Addy, are you okay? Says, ooh, this looks very nice. It is. It is very nice. Unfortunately, we're now at a boss that is um, kicking my little foxy buns. Right, so we've just got to be far away from that attack. Ow. Ow. That's a three hit combo that we want to watch out for. And then he attacks three times like that with the silly ray gun. That's the one we want to be out of the way for. Now we can go say hi for a bit. That was a mistake on my part, but we're still in this. He gets 
locked in when he's firing, so that's good news. That's new and annoying. Fuck. I mistimed that. Cheeky one of these couldn't hurt. Ow! That was just a shotgun, wasn't it? Rolled into that. Yikes! Yikes, yikes, yikes. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there, we're getting there, we're getting there. <laughs> Captain Karimbo says, It's so aggressive. You're a garden knight, my dude. Smell the flowers. Be at peace. Couldn't agree more. Okay. Okay. Oofed. Mmm. Bally Wrong Leg says, Ooh, went AFK for a bit and they're in the night garden? Yeah. This is not what the children's TV led me to believe I would be facing. TV program, TV show. You know what I mean. Chili peppers up your stamina and attack, says Dr. Branga. Well then. Looks like we're eating one of those. It was we no hubris though, please, Johnny. Ow. Ah, oh, that felt cheap. It was nowhere near your bloody gun. That was bad. Dan Keller says, can I give a hint about bombs? Please do. Go on then. Oofed. Do I still have bombs? I have no I have one bum, but it is an ice bomb, so. Oh, but wait a minute. Didn't somebody say it's according to the map? Oh, Davy Jones is in chat. Says, Yeah, I made it in time. Almost. Hello everyone. Hello, Davy. Hope you're well. I'm getting my ass kicked by a big, really aggressive robot. Just livid, so he is. Okay. Okay. Oh, come, come now. Feel like I'm tilting again. Ow. If you keep using bombs, you'll eventually get a message that you feel something in your pocket. From then on, you'll refill a number of bombs at a bonfire. The more you use them, the more refill. Well, well, well. Let's equip our one bomb. Oh, goodness. Why is my phone going off? Is there an emergency? No. Chiffle Spider says, Fox Quixote. What a butthole! <laughs> oh, that's not a bomb. That's not a bomb. It isn't a bomb.
That went bad. Yeah, should have watched out for that. Oh, fuck off. That's so unfair, that bit. We might get there, is my point. Where's the noodle? Okay. Oh, that was lucky. Now come here so I can womp you with this. What? Oh, you bastard. Let's just... Alright. No, don't run towards! Run away! Shit. Ah, oh, that was cheap. I was hoping to just reposition. Okay. Cheerful Spider says, is a garden night like a garden salad? Does it come with croutons? A very good question. Stamina. Ho Let's have that tickle. Yes! As Emma Benton says, Ooh, I'm a giant robot with a sword gun. Ooh, I'm so scary. You said it, Emma. Yes. Oh, yes. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, Josh Langton says, Hi, Johnny. Me and a friend have been binging your videos. Can't wait to catch up on this video with them on the VOD. Um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you and your friends enjoy this one, especially that delicious boss fight that I just finished. Yes, 200 of the delicious bits. Oh. Phew. <laughs> Dr. <laughs> Dr. Branker says, I can see that wild end greed creeping in. Yeah. I got a little bit loosey-goosey toward the end there, didn't I? Num, 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 num. Steve Gilly says, but who will watch the garden now? I think the garden's better off, Steve. Also, I don't know if that's what you sound like. I'm sorry if that was a weird way of <laughs> saying words that you typed. Woofed. Bing. Dong. Woofed. Dan Kelleher says, awesome, Johnny, my hands have just about stopped shaking now from doing the same thing. It That was, that was intense. <laughs> More not bombs. They're blue blue breeze. I love the design on those uh, bridges. Well, well, well. If it isn't some stuff over there, let's go get it. T 
Tom Ireland says, wait, does this game have breakable barrels you can roll through like Dark Souls? What I'm asking is, can Fox do a barrel roll? <laughs> ah, very good. Do a barrel roll. I played that game so much as a child. Right. Well, I rung the West Bell. Now what do we do? Ah. Oh, Tree Man says I introduced Mrs. Tree to Johnny when I first moved in with her a few months ago. I swear by now she's a bigger member of the community than I ever was. That's very sweet. Thank you. Right, let's go to a shrine and level ourselves up a bit. Oh. Oh yeah, we don't we don't have anything to offer. Okay, never mind then. Right, where are we going? Ah, that's okay. Uh, it says, has the name Robin of Foxley been suggested yet? Robin of Foxley is handsome and brave. Little sod could be trouble. Addy, are you okay? Says, I have to go now and have some dinner. Enjoy the rest of the stream. Take care, Addy. I hope you have a lovely evening. Oh, oh yeah, what's this again? Oh yeah, the shop. Forgot about the shop. Oh, hello. Right. Fire bombs, useful. Stamina, stamina weed. What do you cost? Ninety. Yes. Let's do it again. Bombs. Can we afford this? No. No, we can't afford that either. I'm still happy with our purchases. We could always smash another one of these. It's so violent and hilarious. <laughs> Absolutely savage. Oops. Oh no. That's not that's not stamina weed at all. That's something else. Oh well. Oh, it's health health stuff. Okay, that's fine. Well, you live and learn, don't you? Lucy says, is this Skeleton Fox friend? Improbably, yes. Skeleton Fox is friend. Okay. Ah. Uh. This is so this is so lovely though. Right, ringing the east bell. La 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 la. Flooded well, west garden. Feels like we've done all of those things. So we're on to question mark? What does question mark do? The frog's domain? We could go to the frog's domain maybe. Maybe. Ah, big gold gate. Oh yeah, because we rang the things. You'd think I'd pay attention. But I don't, apparently. Big gold door. Nailed it. Thanks, everyone. Ooh. Good. It's like the end of control. Hello! Big spinning thing. This is a delight, this game. I really like it. <gasps> Pages. Echo of self, yes. Try to be this strong. Oh, try to be this strong for the garden. I, I don't think I was. What is this? 
We go ah, we go to one of these and we press A for three seconds. And then lights. Keep an eye on your bars. Yes, use your items, yes. Okay. Let's go to one of those. The booklet is such a wonderful thing. Hmm. <laughs> Could have tried locking on there, Johnny. It probably would have made life a lot easier. Right, where's one of those things then that we can go do that at? And was that really all that there was to do in that place? Ah! Bastards! You're not as bad as the fairies, though, so you get a pass. <gasps> Bits. Yes. Oh! I'm not an arctic fox. What is this bullshit? The coins are for wishes into a well. Inverted ash, muffling bell, the temple, three keys, the ruined atoll, checkpoint dead. I love this. This is so great. Angel Beat says, stay frosty. A Chartreuse Goose says, cold is good. Would love to be cold or cooler right now. Stupid springtime. Agreed. Uh, and Hannah says, uh, where's it gone? Apple Pro of nothing. Trans rights. Goddamn right, Hannah. Trans rights. Let's get out of this snowy biome. What I would like to do is go to one of those things. There was, I think, somebody, I saw somebody say, um, there was one. Uh, words are so hard. Uh, there was one by the uh, Guardian. Oh, let's not overdo it now. All form an orderly queue to get smashed in the face, please. Thank you. Ah. Cyborg Penguin says, I'm officially useless after this point. I haven't gone further than this. Uh, well, thank you nonetheless for all of your assistance. Everyone has been extremely helpful this stream. Not just in actual concrete game tips, but in terms of just... Cheering me on, telling me not to lose hope. Gaming with Geezer says, Johnny, have you played Project Zomboid before? I actually never have. Oh, David Jackson says, a friend bought me a LSP shirt for my birthday, so I'm spending that money on the Super Chat instead. <laughs> That'll show him. It's a, it's a strange logic, sir, but it checks out. 
Uh, thank you very much. It's very generous of you. It's very kind. Oh, that was cool. Did a little roll onto the ladder. Um, yeah, David, that is really lovely. Thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy your shirt when it arrives. Oh, hello. Um, yes, I remember now. We were adventuring. I can't wait to ping one of those coins into a um into a well. That's going to be great fun. Okay. So, let's see. I still remember this. Yes, I do. Do I? Yes, I do. If we wanted to go this way, I think we can slowly get back. But do we actually want to go this way anymore? I don't know. Not really, we don't. But we're doing it. Be nice to farm up a bit. Let's just let's have a pleasant we'll go the long way around. The scenic route, why not? Oops. Oh, no, it's the merchant again. Lucentia says, what happens if you whack the tiny tuning forks? So far, nothing. But, possibly in future, something. Ow. <laughs> Tree Man says, you get tiny tunes? Can't fault the logic. Right. Now, there was one of those... There was one of those big, wacky... Not wacky blocks, the big block thing, right? Why am I being messaged? Oh, this guy again. Why did I come this way? Why did I do it? What was I thinking? What on earth? I didn't need to come this way at all. I just wanted to stumble into one of the blocks that I can apparently kneel in front of. I didn't need to go there. Where even is it? Where even is it? Brain falling away. Dan says you can see them on the map. I don't know where they live. <sighs> ah, I mean, we don't. Come on. It's embarrassing now. Go back to the garden night past the windmill. Okay. Oh, the gut we unlocked that shortcut, didn't we? There's me being clever as usual. Thank you very much, Dr. Branger. Yeah, because there was an obelisk here, right? Hello, Obelisk. I've come to kneel before you and say, oh yeah. Eccentric Lefty has done a super chat saying, Greetings, I have returned from destroying a shed. Oh, that sounds like a good day. I helped a friend destroy his shed recently. Uh, and it was just absolutely delightful. It's great. Smashed it up. Ooh, that went well. Right, obelisk. There was one around here, wasn't there? Ah, oh, shit. Oh, 
Come on, come on. All right. I'm just wandering around aimlessly now, aren't I? But I could have sworn there was an obelisk, like, right around here. Well, farming bits is no bad thing. Abadosian Chew Like 2 says, follow the purple. Ah. Alright. Well, I'm just going to run away from this. Th oh, shit. I was about to say I'm going to run away from this thing, and then I found two more of the bastards. Oh, no. Not you. Right. This guy is persistent and annoying. Okay. Right. Where are we now? Oh, goodness. Oh, there's one. You can see them. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Angel Beats has got to scoot again. Good luck, Johnny. Thanks, Angel Beat. Take care of yourself. Oh, uh, yeah. Hope to see you soon. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, but we can't actually get... Oh, yeah. That's the cruelty, isn't it? That's the cruel irony. How do we get up there? Damn. Oh, well. There we go. I'm a guardian. Not a guardian, I think. In the dark tomb entrance, use the hidden ladder to descend to into the well. Oh, yeah! The dark tomb. I remember. I'm quite tired. My brain's just like... It's also very warm in here. They said, making excuses. This isn't the right way, is it? We're spell tower, though. Where are we now? Oh, no, wait. Yeah, we're doing fine. No, don't go up there. Okay. Dark tomb. Dark tomb. Dark tomb. Dark Tomb entrance use the hidden ladder to descend into the well. No, wait. Ah, fuck. We're doing it again. No, Johnny. Fuck. Oofed. What's down here again? Beneath the well. No, no, I can't. I can't go kill all of those things again. Oh. Uh, you know what, pals? I might have to knock the stream on the head uh, because I my head is falling to bits like some sort of uh, cake. Uh, Cheerful Spider says, Johnny is air frying, not the best. Yes, Lord Mower chopped down a thousand blades of grass. Johnny's air frying, not the best, but at least they'll be in low, <laughs> be low in unhealthy bits. <laughs> uh, well, honestly, it's been a really lovely stream. This game is fabulous. And oh, Lisa Hunter's done a super sticker. You'll remember the pair. Um, the, the pair is, is black. 
basic. Lucanthia says my housemate just accidentally bought six pints of milk. Looks like we're eating a lot of custard and mac and cheese for a while. That's impressive. Anyway, um, uh, yeah, uh, Lisa Hunt has done a super sticker of, of the pear. The pear, it looks like the pear has, has shrunk, but actually I think the pear is just, excuse me, uh, it's further away. As it seems quite small, but then it kind of rockets its thumb toward the screen as if to say, good job. Um, so thank you very much, Lisa, for that super sticker. And thank you, everybody, for watching this stream. Um, I've had a lovely time being a little murderous fox with um, with a little quiff and a sword and a shield and a lantern and um, a, a, a massive disregard for uh, for piggy banks. Um, but that'll about do it for today. So um, what have we got coming up? On Saturday, there'll be uh, new episodes of Press Any Kiadini for all to see. Um, next Monday, I'm going to be doing a painting stream. Next Thursday, I'm thinking about streaming more of the Forgotten City uh, because it's hilarious and uh, we seem to enjoy it last time. So, oh no. Um, Emma Benton has already shared a link to my Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. If you want to check that out, it is good. I like to think so. Uh, Chris Butler has done a super sticker of a little Shiba Inu kind of nodding its head as if to bow rev 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 reverently, referentially, deferentially. It's basically go doing, doing this, and it's quite nice. Uh, so thank you very much for that, Chris. Um, but yeah, uh, don't forget also... Um, T-shirts are available for a limited time if you look in the description of this stream or on my Twitter, yada, yada, yada. Um, but yeah, that'll about do it. Thank you again so much. Uh, have a lovely rest of your day, however much there is. I'll catch you soon. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.